Well, time to work on some more of our business in the castle before we leave. There's a few more things we need to do. Well, I guess we can talk to the king real quick. It won't go well. Excuse me, King Allfire. Flicker, leave me. I'm thinking through a strategy for when my knights return. A strategy with no information. No wonder, you know, we're led by world-class leaders here in Camel Hut. Well, now. Flicker, this is my bedroom. Next time, knock, please. But if I did that, I couldn't catch you, you know, naked. At least I assume that's Flicker's goal. Right? He does want to marry you. Boom. Yep, I know. Excuse me. Flame? Flicker, have you done it? Are you a squire? Uh, I'm close, Flame. Honest. Hurry, Flicker. I refuse to marry against my will. Unless it's to me, huh? Do you have any more advice about becoming a knight? Nope. But here's a kiss for good luck. Oh no, I can't catch it. I don't have a jar. That's awful. Well, we can fix that problem. Could we try that good luck kiss thing again? Boom. Put that away for later. Flame. Flicker. Okay. Can't you talk the king out of forcing you to marry? Use your feminine wiles. You know, smile sweetly. Lock him in a half, Nelson. I tried, but he reversed me into a figure four leg lock. Damn. Flame. Flicker. Getting impatience, I see. So, um, uh, what sort of dragon do you want to marry? Well, the dragon of my dreams is sensitive. The other day I saw a rainbow so beautiful, I wept. Of course he'd have to be funny. Did you hear about the human who thought manual labor was a famous Spanish painter? Brave. He'd have to be brave. I'm almost completely over that nightlight phase. I swear. And most important of all, he'd have to be covered in tattoos that say, I belong to flame. Fine, I'll check the docks and get back to you. Touchy. Can't be just one tattoo on my butt like a tramp stamp. Uh, I guess he's not willing to negotiate. Okay, let's get out of there. I'm gonna grab the uh, bottle of hair tonic, right? I'm gonna need that. Uh, we'll double check that in a I moment. Don't have sinus problems, but this pipe cleaner might come in handy. Boom. Okay. And let's grab these two. I'll just take the monarch quarterly along in case I get a sudden bout of insomnia. Yep. Someone might need those if they need to take a nap. Okay, yeah, we did grab it. Okay. Well, nothing else to do here. At least for now. I don't know if there's any reason, ever a reason to come back, but... Let's just leave, right? Okay, need to take this uh, gate to get out of here. And there's no reason to pay the Chancellor a visit. Okay. Your pardon. Yes. What can I do for you? Well, no. I need your help. I have to locate the Knights of the Square Table. I've got a semi-enchanted map. It will show you where you want to go, even if you don't know you want to go there. How's it semi-enchanted? But uh, uh, okay. I assume it's either enchanted or it's not, right? I beg your pardon. Yes. What can I do for you? Yeah. What's the easiest way to become a squire? Kiss some nice butt flicker. It hurts, but it's worth it. Oh heavens me, did I just say that? <laughs> can I have some useless information? The most visited spot in all of Camel Hot is the king's bathroom. Ever since he went on that liquid ruby diet, the king's been in there five times an hour. Damn. Unfortunately, she doesn't have any more useless information. What are you knitting? Oh, my little boy's grown another two feet since last week. I just can't keep up. Now, what can I do for you? Ah. Uh. I need one of those, um, things. You know. You mean one of those diddly bops you put on your, well, you know. 
Exactly. But without the doohickey on the end. Either you want a new bowstring for your crossbow, or I should slap your face. Either way, I can't help you. Can't slap me across the face? Eh, whatever. All the information I need. Probably should get heading out. After all, we have all the details we need for now. Okay. I can see where all four knights have gone. Well, first things first, we're heading to town. We have a date with a catapult. Lance, the royal mole is ruining the streets of Camelot. Well, I can't do anything about that at the moment. We'll worry about it later. For now, we need to take care of this stuff. Okay. Help me out, my little friends. Termites for later. Yep, we're gonna need those. I know, the downside of playing these games and you already know all the answers means you can go by them it's real fast. Catapult target range, where knights practice raining cats, but never dogs, against enemy castles. Probably because George has a dog. All I have to do is aim the catapult, adjust the tension, and release. If I hit 9 out of 10 wooden knights, I get a shot at the big Sir George cutout for the win. Okay. Uh, okay. Boom. Took up a second one. Scratch the third one. Well, play this enough times, you start to memorize where everyone's at. Okay. Okay. Seven down. Victory is near. I know, right? Okay, I messed this one up. Yeah. Okay. If I get there in time, it's nine. Okay. Got him. I did it. I win. I am master of the catapult range. I know, right? Okay, let's take you with us. The poor fella took a lot of punishment. I'd better hold on to him. Yep, I know, right? Okay. Let's just get out of here for now. Oh, we could go pay Trivet a visit in the arena, but let's face it, he's not very funny. It's kind of the joke, you know, he's terrible at his job of being a jester. But I got more important things to do right now than listening to him try and be funny. Okay, we're gonna have to go here first, because we need a lot of stuff here. This is the home for the grimly insane, where they treat clinically depressed storybook characters. Ooh. Magic beans. This one looks good. Well, let's put that in the bag. Okay. Don't ask me what I need the hair for. I don't remember right now. <laughs> but I do know I need it. Oh wait, it's for later, yeah. Okay. How's it hanging? Stay away! Any more of that tonic and I'll be able to tuck my bangs into my sock! I won't splash you again, you have my word. What I'd really like to have is that hair tonic. How about you hand over the bottle and I'll give you my clippers? Nah, I have the strangest desire to collect a lot of junk lately. Well, okay. Boom. Okay. Let's go in here, I suppose. Oh, you think your mother eats a... A, a dragon. Oh, good sir, I don't have time for this. Ah, you have a classic case of scale in me. Now, think of that silly costume. This isn't a costume. I'm a dragon. And you, sir, are a fraud. Yes! I am Dr. Zygmunt Ford, specialist in the disturbed, the confused, and the loony nut boys. What a mess. Suburnib is trapped. I know, right? Well, we'll start working on that problem next time. Until then, see ya. Oh.